great defenses and offenses from both. And uh, I just let's just point out the Twitch chat is being absolutely phenomenal right now. Twitch.tv slash altfire for any of those that are, you know, into that sort of thing. Let's have a, a little bit less of the uh, negative comments from Seraphic Fox uh, because we will ban you. And uh, we are undoubtedly going to be seeing some different picks. Yeah, it, I'm looking forward to that. We're going to see a bit of out there picks from both sides, a bit of different strategies that we from both sides, and it's going to be really interesting to see where these teams are going to match up against each other. So, first point, it's going to be straight into the middle, straight in there, and, well. Anna, checking in. Uh, I'm, I'm... Oh, wow. Yeah, there, there is a... A lot of fighting going on around the jump jump pad, and we're seeing. No, they're not. They finally decide to jump down onto the point. It's all well and good with a holding strat, but if you don't take that point, that's going to get you nowhere. Phantom Owl slept. Finally woken up by the scatter arrow coming in from Danielle. Now we see him, your KS die being the first one to be taken out. Donkey Mouse follows. He's dead. Uh, I mean, it doesn't matter who you are, stealth or not, when a Bastion sees you, you're probably dead. So uh, we'll, we'll see the defense start to set up from ASF. They do, but we'll see just how successful that is going to be with Pure Chaos Die. He has been very well on D.Va so far. We've seen some really good ults from him. We're going to see him de-suited from his mech now. Still taking a bit of damage. We've seen... Ooh, Mad Prof Chance going in on the Genji to try and counter this um, Bastion, we would assume. I am... Um, it is not a hero that is usually in his skill set due to technical difficulties he, he usually goes in with. However, we are very excited to see how we will fare on this high difficulty character but you know I'm, I'm expecting good things from him oh fred start on the traitor we weren't expecting him to be uh oh it is the tank it's the damage boosted tank and he's been slept what a wonder dart from seraphic fox oh my word and oh we do see danielle with the roadhog trying to get in there but Unfortunately, Ramcharan's shield just pushes him away. The Ananade comes in, but they can't follow up on it. Oh, and that is the Mercy taken out by Daniel. What a beautiful hook. He knows how to use that well. Oh, that is a brilliant play. They can't quite get on the point. They're taking this up. Seraphic Fox again with the Sleep Dart coming in. We've seen Pure Chaos Day frozen, taken out by Ramcharan. Oh, that was worse than a Team Gang Bang on a Saturday. I mean... Oh. And we are seeing Logical Chalk with some major picks there as May. I mean, he is definitely an advocate for May as Bay, and we are seeing that here. Danielle with it. Oh, EMP has gone in. We see... They see the ultimate status. We have one player left on point. Roadhog slept. Oh. He did. Ramtram pushes him out. He's back on point, but doesn't quite contest it, and... First round definitely deservedly goes to ASF. Oh. To I mean, we've already seen a lot of switches, a lot of different compositions, especially coming out from Buzan. So we'll see what they set up with here, how they decide to go for it, and whether they do stick. To that single healer setup but seraphic fox has been doing really good work on his honor so he's definitely utilizing every tool in her kit and uh 
be interesting to see where the fight starts to engage in this map. Are there anyone? Oh my word, that is... Oh! The uh, charge unfortunately just missing from Mad Prof Jams. We are seeing a hammer war between him and Ramtran. Ramtran winning that battle. We got a decent Ananade on to two of the tanks from ASF, but unfortunately for Buzan, no dice. We will see the point capped initially by ASF. Yes. I mean, he is one of the most aggressive Torbjorns that I've ever seen. And uh, it'll be interesting to see whether his tactics can really come to fruition here. We are seeing some a nice arrows coming in and a dueling from, uh, well, I was about to say nice from Fredster. But unfortunately, his hands are always taken out. And uh, again, we're seeing really, really solid work on the point. And um, Pure Chaos just dancing around as a far it. He's on point trying to contest, but... He's not going to be a chink, even though he's on the Zarya. Uh, we're seeing Donkey Mouse being forced back away. Really good Ryan work from Ramtran. Don't think I've seen him die yet. He's been an ever present on this point. And with pairing up with the Diva and the Zarya on a chink, who is just melting through, he is bursting and getting a lot of ult charge here. We soon will see. No, that's very true. They have been quite split. And we do see a solo ult from Mad Prof Jans. But unfortunately, even though Ramtran was tucked down, Logical Chop came in. Brilliant work with the mate to zone him, freeze him, and take him out. We see a diving Fara come in from Pure Chaos. Doesn't manage to get that tiny little bit extra before his ult. Can't get any the barrage. Oh, this is stealthy. This is stealthy work from Seraphic Fox. On foot, we can't do it. Uh, the point was being contested. It is being contested. He's not on the point. He has to dive down. Oh, that's the best stealth I've seen since the famous Lucio hiding in the bushes on the final point of Numbani. Unfortunately, it doesn't. Ah. Oh. Unfortunately, no matter how much stealth they try to pull out, they do not get a single percentage on here. And that's two points to zero in the way of ASF. And unfortunately, it does look like Buzan are going to be going out with a whimper. Their strat's just not quite working out. And, uh... I'll be watching over you. This place is a big name's McCree. Soldier 76, reporting for duty. Quit screwing around. Wow, oh, just quickly before you think about pulling out what they should do, let's just take a brief look at the selections from ASF. This is not what we're used to seeing on there. There's obviously some discussions going on amongst themselves. We're seeing... Oh. I mean... Yes, I mean, this is this is very, very nice sunbathing there, but unfortunately, he's not actually doing much for the team. L let's see if he can make this jump. He can. can. The fabulous jump, jump round. Now, let's see how much damage he can pepper in, because so far, the centre of that point has just been wiped out, and it does look, yes, again, that ASF will take it, and Bad Prof Chance just knocked off by the concussion grenade from XRS. Brilliant play from him, and uh... Ooh, oh, I'm just saying we've got a very interesting battle on point just before XS took out Seraphic Fox. We did have a battle mercy off, and Ellipsis showing that he has been the superior. He stayed alive, and he's is he going to actually get the kill on Donkey Mouse? Donkey Mouse doesn't notice him. 
Oh! Oh, that is fantastic work. Great headshots, popping in. Don't him out, didn't know what hit him. And Rez is up now. Oh, let's... It ri uh. Oh, this is absolutely fabulous. He does get the res off. He decides Battle Mercy is not all it is. Pure chaos. He is trying to get on point. He's trying to contest with his Lucio. Seeing how well this new Lucio can duel, bounce around. But let's face it, he's never going to be good at dueling. The absolute basher that is Logical Chalk. Petra, she has been absolutely phenomenal, and as we can see, 0% ult charge, and you know why? Because the support she's given with her ult, the shield generator, how it has not been found yet by Boozan, I do not know, but we have seen the counter Symmetra pick from Madprof Chance, let's see whether this can actually uh, come to fruition for them, because we're seeing a lot of high offense. Ah. Uh, Oh, so, someone's on point. They're finally coming back. And, uh, unfortunately, this is going to be 3-0 to zero in favour of ASF. I think, in the end, it, they weren't. It's unfortunate we saw some great plays from many people, but let's take a look at this beautiful play of the game from x -Ref. No environmental kills on this one. It, all we're going to see. Ah, oh, there it is.